गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स आर टूडेज टॉपिक फॉर साइंस क्लासेस स्पाइनल कॉर्ड नर्व्स एंड रिफ्लेक्स सेक्शन सो इन द चैप्टर ऑफ स्केरेटल सिस्टम वी हैव टॉक्ड अबाउट दैट स्पाइनल कॉर्ड इज अ वेरी डेलिकेट ऑर्गन व्हिच इज प्रोटेक्टेड बाय द बैकबोन और द स्पाइन सो इन दैट चैप्टर वी हैव स्टडीड दैट देर आर टोटल थर्टी थ्री वर्टिब्री विच टूगेदर फॉर्म द वर्टिब्रल कॉलम और द स्पाइन दिस स्पाइन protects the delicate spinal cord and the spinal cord is a thick bundle of nerves that connect the brain with all the body parts it starts from the back portion of the brain that is the medulla and continues down to the lower end of our backbone like uh, have you to- uh, studied about early man and uh, we know that the man has evolved from the monkeys and chimpanzees so at that time they were having the tail but now as a uh, modern human being has evolved so we are not having tail because the tail was the lower part of the backbone now this uh, tail bone of the backbone is no longer exist so we are not having the tail let's see what is all about the nerves nerves are made up of special cells called as the nerve cells or the neurons each neuron has two main parts cyton and the axon as you can see in this diagram the cyton almost looks like a very dried tree just like the branches of a dried tree so this is the upper part is cyton and the lower tail region is called as the axon axon are also known as nerve fibers now just like if you have seen any cable or any wire in a one, in a single wire there are so many different different wires inside of it like if you have seen an open section of a tv cable okay so in the main wire there are so many thin wires inside of it just like that the nerves also are similar to that a single nerve consists of so many nerve fibers there may be thousands of fibers in a single nerve our body has a network of nerves to carry messages between the brain and other parts of the body now let's see there are three types of nerves number 1 is the sensory or afferent nerves these nerves carry messages from the sense organs like the eyes ears nose tongue and skin we know that there are five sense organs so these type of nerves sensory nerves carry messages from the sense organs and deliver these messages to the brain and the spinal cord now the next type is motor or efferent nerves motor nerves are the type of nerves which carry messages from the brain or spinal cord to the different parts of the body like whatever we see or we hear or we uh, smell any kind of delicious food these are all sensed by the sense organs and these messages from the sense organ are delivered to the brain by the sensory nerves now we want to have a response to this kind of delicious food so it is all carried uh, by the motor nerves these nerves carry the messages from the brain and then our muscles or the glands react to the Uh, things which we sense now third category is the mixed nerves these nerves carry messages to the brain and bring orders from the brain now on page 149 next topic is reflex section what is reflex section it is an automatic reaction of the body to an event all our actions are controlled by the nervous system but some of the actions are automatic and we do not take time or think before doing them so these type of actions are reflex actions let's see for an example when we accidentally touch something hot or any hot plate hot object or even while ironing the clothes if we touch hot iron our hand automatically pulls itself away the reflex action allows a fast reaction we don't take any time 
in thinking or what we have to do in that situation we don't take time it is a very fast reaction it is because the spinal cord sends orders through motor nerves for the muscles to tighten up in this way we pull our hand away from the hot object before any feeling of pain before we sense anything uh, our action is performed this is reflex action these type of actions are not controlled by the brain these type of actions are only controlled by the spinal cord so see this diagram which you will have to draw in your fair notebooks while writing the notes let's see suppose you sense pain and the message of pain will immediately reach the spinal cord the outer portion which you can see here it is the backbone and inside of it you can see that these nerves cluster together and this is the spinal cord so this message from the muscles or our hand are carried to the spinal cord through the sensory nerves now after that spinal cord will react and send a message through the no motor nerves to our muscles of the hand and our hand is pulled back so this is a very short reaction which is carried within milliseconds and we don't take time to think about them these are reflex actions this is a very important topic which you have to remember and learn